Hey gang, Vinny here. Vin's Bug Shop. Find me on a website, www.2beonthewater.com. Also, uh, Facebook page. We're going to tie an Estaz egg today, but we're going to tie it in with a chorus. We're going to use two colors of Estaz. All right? Simple. Estaz eggs are simple, and they work. This just makes it look a little cooler by giving it a core. Okay? Today, we're going to use opalescent orange Estaz and red. Red's going to be our core. Okay? The hook I'm using right now is a Mustad C67S in a size 4. You can use any scud hook you want. I like the Togans 3 times strong scud hook. It's a great hook. It's just they come from Canada, so I'm, they're in the mail. I'm waiting on them to get down here. Thread, start at the front to the back. And stop so the thread is hanging off the barb. Okay? I'm using orange. You can use red thread for this color pattern. I mean, honestly, you can use whatever color you want. Main color is opalescent salmon. So we're going to use a 5-inch piece of that. Make sure when you latch this down, the fibers are flowing backward. Okay? And then we're also going to use a 5-inch five, five piece of red for the core. You're going to get probably two flies out of the 5-inch piece here with minimal waste. And you're probably going to get four or five flies out of the 5-inch red piece. So when we tie this in... Have that Estaz right at the hook point, and then wind backward. Stop at the tying point, which is right off the barb. This is going to be tied in three sections. This is the rear section. This is going to have four wraps. Okay, that's not a wrap. We're just anchoring it, securing it, making it tight. So we're going to do four wraps. So there's one, two, three, four, and we're done. We're right on that hook point. couple wraps over the top, wraps in front, secure that in, snip the material away, push the thread out, out of the way, snip the material, and come back, clean it up if you want, and tie in the red now, this is the core, we're only, we're going to take two wraps of the core, that's it, two wraps, that's all we need, two wraps, so that's just our anchor to get it nice and snug, okay, so then it's two, it's one, Two, and secure that in. Couple wraps over the top, couple wraps in front. Careful with the hook points; so you don't catch your thread. Don't want to break your thread. All right, that's secured in. Push that thread away. Snip the material. Right, pull it back a little bit. Clean up. Get our opalescent salmon again. We're gonna tie that in, and we're gonna get three wraps of the opalescent salmon here in the front so you got four wraps in the back two in the center for your core color and then we're gonna go three in the front if you could squeeze if you could squeeze four in the front go ahead but you don't want to crowd the, the eye of the hook we want to be able to make a neat, nice neat head I means it's an egg pattern but still want it to look somewhat neat so there we got three and I got plenty of space there to make a nice neat head now Just secure that in, couple over the top, couple in front. Push your thread away. Snip the material. And what I'll do is I'll pull all the fibers backward. Couple wraps, secure that up. I'll check underneath, make sure that my core is not exposed. It's all covered up. Again, that's just me. It could be exposed. It's not going to mean anything, just the way it looks. So. Starting a nice neat head, whip finisher, I'm going to do five and five. Snip. Head cement. Alright, you guys watch my videos. I love Fly Tight by Fly Right. Stuff doesn't stink, doesn't eat the color off the beads You're for your bead head flies or off the bead chain eyes looks good so there you have it very simple fly but just adding a little color to it make it look like it's an egg with a core all right you can do it in, in a dead egg color you do it with a with like a peach estaz and then like a orange estaz for the core and then peach in the front again do whatever you guys want to do but that's just a simple way to Add a little more to your Estaz egg. Make it look a little different than everybody else's, okay? Alright, get up there catch some salmon. Thanks for watching.